Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to combine multiple row values into a single cell in Power Query using Power BI. Let me switch to the computer for the demo. So from Power BI desktop, I will go to the Power Query editor. So here I will click on transform data and again click on the transform data. And now it is opening a Power Query editor. And this is my table actually, region table. So let me zoom in. So as you can see here, the column, region and country. So as you can see the region North America is like, you know, repeated multiple time. And there are the other region also. If I load data, you can see. So Europe and Pacific. And here also you can see other countries if I load. So Australia, Germany, France and so on. So basically why what I want. So I want a North America one time and like, you know, United States and other country Canada is a comma separated in North America, United States comma Canada. And I want for the other region as well. So what I am going to do first thing, I will select both the columns and now I'll right click and I will say remove duplicate. So now you can see duplicate has been removed. Now you can see North America, United States, North America, Canada, Europe, France and so on. So what I want single time North America, United States, comma Canada for the Europe also uh, France, UK and Germany in the comma separated. So now from here, I will click on group by group by and here new column name is country country and from operation what I'm going to select is all rows and let me click OK. So now country is converted into a table and here you can see the region is unique. So you can you can see the North America only one time. If I will click here, so you can see here North America, United States, North America, Canada. Similarly for Europe and Pacific also. So you can see here also Europe. So now I want now what I'm going to do, I will go to the group by and just I will expand this. Let me select this. And now I'll here you can see now. So what I'm going to do, I will remove all this part from here to here. Okay. Now I will convert this table into a list. So what I'm going to do in the square bracket, I will write a country column names here. Country. So if I'll press enter button, you can see the now country column is converted into a list. If I'll select here, so you can see the country. You can see the country. Now, here i will use a one function text dot combine and open bracket and here if you can see here the text so this is country is my text list is my text and this is the separator so here i will say comma double quotes, comma, space. And just let me hit the enter button. So here bracket is missing. So let me hit the enter button. So now you can see here North America, United States and Canada. For Europe, France, UK and Germany, if I'll expand this. Germany. 
for this specific we have only one country australia so now you can see how it is combined by comma separated you can use some another like you know um, anything instead of comma so now let me apply and close and from here i will go to the uh, now it is refreshing so just wait for few second now here in the relationship i will just established a relationship between region and this is my dimension table now and this is fact table this is the sales data and i will say region so one to many relationship as you can see here so one to many relationship now let me go back to the power bi and i will add a just table visual here and let me expand and from here the region table i will add a region and then i will add a country and from the sales table i will add total sales okay and now i will add total order quantity so as you can see now europe these are the countries and the total sales and the total order quantity that's all for this video and i request you to please subscribe my channel thank you for watching